When you've got a burning health question, you know you can always come to us. It's time to hashtag Ask the Doctors. And our first question comes from Facebook. Sharon asks, I'm overweight and a candidate for breast reduction surgery. However, I've been told my skin is thin. What can I do to help me prepare my skin for surgery? I do not want to bust open and have complications with the surgery. And I like this question. I like somebody that's being proactive and thinking about their surgery ahead of time. What can I do that we don't have wound problems? But in surgery, as surgeons, we're prepared for all skin types. Just because you have thinner skin doesn't mean you're not going to do well. We know how to address that. We may sew things a little bit differently. We will make sure that there's not undue pulling on that skin. So the bottom line is your thin skin will do just fine, but prepare yourself for surgery. What should you do? Well, eat right. Uh, make sure that you're getting all the necessary vitamin supplements, things that we know that promote healing. And, and prepare your skin, whether it's your body, your face. Keep it moisturized, protect it from the sun. All of those will help prevent complications. Dr. Jordan, I have a question. So what about smoking? Because I know thin oh. skin, things like that. I mean, how long before and after? Because you talk about, I mean, you know, surgery in the abdomen and other areas. I, I, see I the scar, but... A very important point, and all surgeons and performing procedures, we know the deleterious effect of smoking on anything that we do. So if you want to avoid healing problems with any type of surgery, stop your smoking. And I'm talking about minimum of three weeks longer. And, you know, for my patients, because... If, if they don't stop smoking, we're going to have problems. I check nicotine levels, and if the nicotine is up, oh. that they're not a candidate. They've, they've got to go back and do their homework. And as gratifying as the results with the surgery, sometimes getting somebody to quit smoking yeah. because they want to have this elective surgery so much is a big, is a big plus.